Uganda's ambition to produce 20 million bags of coffee by the year 2025 is possible. However, it may need a strategic and multi-sectoral approach with the youth taking the lead. Eduardo Sampaio is a Brazilian coffee expert. Well, definitely, youth will be part of it, uh, adopt. Without the youth, there will be no progress and no reaching of the target. Eduardo believes that benchmarking with successful coffee-producing countries such as Ethiopia, Brazil and Vietnam is critical for Uganda to realize the 2025 coffee sector dream. I think you have to rethink the numbers. Uh, you rather have on a secure track uh, than on a uh, more difficult, unreachable task. So I think I would uh, recommend to rethink and do the strategy again. Mr. Eduardo Sampaio was addressing mainly youthful participants at the African Fine Coffee Association Partalk at the Pearl of Africa Hotel in Kampala. This initiative is the first of its kind in Uganda and seeks to expose the youthful agripreneurs to various business opportunities available in the Coffee Valley chain. So let us start from production. Then we have traders, we have local traders who can come in and they can begin playing within that space. Then we have exporters and then finally we have, right at the end, we have the coffee shops and roasteries. They have to be exposed to entire coffee value chain. They need to acquire the necessary skills. All that they know, good agricultural practices. How about skills in, in terms of processing coffee? in terms of roasting coffee, that's where real money is. Uganda's coffee sector is dominated by aging people, thereby posing a challenge to increased coffee production ambitions. The thing is we do not want to invest. We are used to saying, um, I think we should write a proposal and apply for a fund. I think we need an organization to do this and this for us. But what have you done for yourself? Because at the end of the day you're doing this business, it's for your own benefit. The knowledge that you have, with the little that you have, you can organize, you know, there, there are people out there, especially for the youth, the young ones, the people who are willing to help them out. As long as you can come up with a very good proposal, the money here doesn't come a problem. Charlotte Amuge for UBC Business.